I'm uh, Gail Smith. I'm Vice President of the Ono Fire Company, and this is Matt Hattrick, and he's the Fire Chief for the Ono Fire Company. So we have developed an application, and it's very simple. We're just asking for $50,000 for apparatus funding for the new Seagrave, 1997 brand new Seagrave pumper we're just put into service this summer. No, the cot we the cot we would be the applicant on their behalf. Right, but where would the funds come from? Dolphin County from the gaming. Dolphin County. Dolphin, yeah, we would yeah. submit okay. the applications to the Dolphin County commissioners. Okay. And then they would. Yes. How much did that cost? Uh, it cost us one hundred fifty-five thousand. Um, we were able to. Uh, we sold our old bumper for a hundred thousand. I'm sorry, ninety-five or hundred thousand. So we, we, all in all, we had about 60000 with the additional funds it cost to upfit the, the rig we just purchased to our specs. So uh, we're, we're, looking, we're looking for 50000 We have a plan to pay for it, but since this became an option just recently, uh, we felt like it would be an, a good way for us to go for our little fire company. Board, have, have you had any conversations with Dolphin County? In advance, and have you had assurances that, uh, that that they would look at this favorably? I talked to their commissioners, uh, but I have no assurances on anything. But uh, what I've been told is that uh, we could apply, uh, and you know, on their behalf, on the fire company's behalf. That's, that's what I've been told. Uh, but no, they're not guaranteeing anything. I don't think they know, quite honestly. I respect everything that you do and represent. And as much as I believe Lebanon County and East Hanover, Hanover Township and the fire company <coughs> especially deserve this money, um, I did both go on their website and call Dolphin County to find out what this story was because I needed to have firsthand knowledge and to make a vote today because I want to do the right thing. And um, I talked to an Amy Richards and a Mark Stewart at Dauphin County. And I respectfully was not told the same thing that you were told. Um, and neither was I. As a volunteer fire company, as any volunteer fire company, we don't want to pass up any opportunity for grant money. You are, you're an elected supervisor, or are you going to be a supervisor? Yes, in January. Have you talked to the supervisors? I have not received thing? any word about this at all from our supervisors. So. Uh, I have put in calls to both the president of the township supervisors, Larry Miller, and we have calls into Tom Dunware, and neither have been returned. I've left messages with Well, Tom's on vacation, I know, because I tried to call him. I didn't even know that. We, yeah. you know, we don't get that information, so. I admire you so much, and, and I, I, I know that you can do this, but going to the township is the proper vehicle based on what I was told by the people who administer the grants for Dolphin County. That's what they told me. On July 6th, I had a meeting with them. That's what they told us. I respect, but I, I know that others were told differently. I understand that, and I also understand it's a new program. But I, I would like to, uh, to uh, you know, apply it. I'll make a motion that... Well, can't uh, we finish talking before you sure. make a motion? She's well, not done talking yet, and I want to talk. Well, we'll give you, I'll give you plenty of time to talk as much as you want, Bill. I and know you will. But I'd, <laughs> well, I'll I have every right to talk. You, okay. You're not going to authorize my talking. I'm not. Uh, I am going to run the meeting, and I'm going to make a motion uh, that we do apply for a, a gaming grant on behalf of uh, the Ono Fire Company to uh, Dolphin County. And now, uh, go ahead. I, I was... In, at a program a couple went Tuesdays ago up in Dolphin in uh, Derry Township, and after the meeting, uh, Nick DeFrancesca, who was there from Dolphin County, asked me to call Mr. Dunmore to let him know that the deadline to get the application in was September 1st for this year, which I, I did that. I also called him to let him, let Matt know that if they wanted to do something, that they had till September 1st, and that's when he found out that they were meeting Mr. Dunmoyer, who told me they had a project, what much like Bill described here, through East Hanover, Dolphin County, and for a road and a bridge. That's a fine project, and he had a very nice plan. I thought, you know, half a million dollars, 250 one year, 250 the next year, a two-year plan. And he had considered the fire company and the other. My understanding, again, from talking to the other commissioners, was that we could also apply, and we could apply for the fire company. I said, "Well, if they don't meet and they don't, and they already submitted theirs through one, that's fine. 
why don't we as the county then do something on behalf of the fire company? And they have two grants, we have two opportunities then to get money from two municipalities, the county and the township, into Lebanon County, two possible ways to get some of the gambling money. You know, personally, I'd, you know, not interested in fighting with Dolphin County, you know, or spending any more money on, you know, pursuing any lawsuits or any of that stuff. But uh, the worst they can do is look at it and say no. It does absolutely no harm. It's not going to jeopardize anything in the future. I believe all three of us have a good working relationship with the Dolphin County Commissioners. I good. don't want to jeopardize your chances at future grants. And if we stick our nose in where it's not wanted, I'm afraid that could happen. And if you're the, a new supervisor, I really want you guys to have the best chance to get the money. I, I was invited to a meeting on July 6th at Farmer's Wife, and at the meeting was Nick D. Francisco, County, uh, County Commissioner, Chad Saylor, Chief Clerk, Mike Musser, a consultant, Attorney Clint Collusion, Attorney Mark Stewart, Tom Dong Moyer from East Hanover Township, and myself. Dauphin County was offering an olive branch for us to be able to apply. They, they stand firm that we are not entitled to the money, mm -hmm. but they are willing to let us apply. But all applications must go through East Hanover Township. They made that perfectly clear that they are not going to recognize the county commissioners. And he wasn't offending me at all. He just wanted to let, let us know up front the only people that they would recognize would be East Hanover Township supervisors, and they would have to be sponsored by East Hanover Township supervisors. We did talk about fire apparatus at the meeting, and, and they said that, that at some point they would look upon it favorably. But Tom's big concern at that meeting was some road he wanted paved. And I don't know the name of the road, to be honest with you. And a bridge. And Tom said that uh, that's what they would apply, and maybe Dolphin County, East Hanover, would apply for the other half, and then they could all do it at once. Tom also was concerned that this wouldn't affect Dolphin County, East Hanover, Dolphin County's uh, position, and they said that it wouldn't. They would still be clear. Tom was also concerned about the Sunshine Law because he didn't want to do anything that would be illegal and there was only one county commissioner there, there was only one supervisor there, and only one county commissioner from Dauphin County there. Right? He was going to go back. I pulled out. I said, look, it looks like it's worked out now. It looks like we're going to get something with the, the cooperation of East Hanover Dauphin County. I'll pull back. I don't have to say another word about it. I always say a lot can be accomplished if it doesn't matter who gets the credit. We're not entitled to any of the credit. I'm telling you right now. Tom Dunmoyer is the supervisor. And they said, just submit one project this year. You know, just do one project this year. And down the road, you know, we'll, we'll get to the fire company and we'll take care of the fire company too. But me last night, it would be rejected. Wow. Point blank, be rejected. Because we're not entitled to it, and, th and they're not going to give in to that point. They don't want it to look like we're entitled to anything, because they're standing firm on the law the way it is, that they are the host county, and they control the funds. I don't want to get them upset about at us. I mean, they're, they're willing to do something for us now. Why do we want to tick them off? Well, I don't the, think by asking we're ticking them off. And I, well, I do. Well, I, I understand that. But I, from my perspective, I don't think we're ticking them off. And the only way we will really know is if we put in an application and ask them. They and we know told me, Larry, we nobody twice. That's fine. It, I heard different reports from Dolphin County. The Dolphin County, someone, who told you that they would accept them? Jeff Haste. No, he didn't tell you that, Larry. He said he'd look into it. Well, they'd look at it. <laughs> That's look, what he said. He did yeah. not say they'd accept yeah. it. They, we can apply. And if they say no, they say no. I realize we're not entitled to anything, but we can ask. And he well, told me we can ask. I'm not telling you that right well, now. I'm not and trying that's to. What that's no, what you're trying not to at do. all. Not at all. Not at all. That's what you're trying to do in here this morning, is bully. No, that's you. No, that's no, your no. Name. Yeah.